My name is Dr. Walt Orenstein. I am a professor of medicine, pediatrics, global health and epidemiology at Emory University, and one of the four editors of Plotkin's Vaccines, eighth edition. For 16 years, I was director of the United States Immunization Program at the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, CDC, and a co-editor of the textbook vaccines for the last six editions. The other three editors, Paul Offit, Kathy Edwards, and Stan Plotkin, are giants in the field of vaccinology. Plotkin's Vaccines is a comprehensive textbook covering all the critical aspects of vaccinology, including the clinical characteristics of current vaccine preventable diseases, including potential complications of infection, health burden, key issues for diagnosis, groups at high risk of diseases, and transmission patterns, among other disease-related factors. While most of the chapters are devoted to diseases for which vaccines are available, a number of the chapters cover diseases for which rigorous efforts are being made to develop vaccines, such as vaccines to prevent HIV and respiratory syncytial virus or RSV. In addition, substantial text is devoted to describing the characteristics of the microorganisms against which vaccines are designed to protect. The chapters on specific diseases and vaccines also cover information on clinical trials that led to approval of the vaccine, including comprehensive discussions of safety and effectiveness data. The chapters also cover recommendations for use of the vaccines, recommended, recommended vaccination schedules, contraindications, and the impact of the use of vaccines in various populations. More than 60 chapters are devoted to licensed vaccines and vaccines under development. In addition, there is a chapter focused on non-infectious disease vaccines. While most of the text is devoted to specific vaccines, there are also chapters devoted to describing the history of vaccination, vaccine immunology, non-specific effects of vaccines, correlates of protection, vaccine adjuvants, vaccine additives, passive immunization, and descriptions of vaccine manufacturing and the vaccine industry. In addition, there are chapters focused on new technologies for making vaccines, such as genetic-based vaccine vectors and technologies designed to improve vaccine uptake. Vaccines don't save lives in their own right. Vaccinations save lives. Thus, Plotkin's Vaccines 8th edition has substantial text covering recommendations for specific populations such as the immunocompromised, vaccines for international travel, vaccines for healthcare personnel, and vaccines for pregnant women. In addition, a whole section is devoted to public health and regulatory issues in diverse settings, including the US, Europe, and low and middle income countries. Further, there are chapters dealing with the comprehensive systems in place to assess vaccine safety during real, real world use of vaccines, the problem of vaccine hesitancy, and potential ways to overcome it, and legal issues. The book is comprehensively referenced the print version includes ebook e and access. In addition, Plotkin's Vaccines 8th edition is a superlative source of information on all aspects of vaccination. Anyone who works with vaccines, from basic scientists to the immunization provider, can benefit with access. Mm -hmm.